Welcome to another fireside chat. Today we have Ming Ming Shi from China, who is one of our marketing Martech managers, specifically focused in the Asia region, but really an expert when it comes to China and the solutions for China. How are you doing, Ming Ming? Yeah, I'm great. Good to Hi, see you. How's the weather on China these days? Uh, actually, it's heavy rain since last one month in my place, and uh, we are no longer talking about COVID nineteen. We are talking about flood. <laughs> are you a big fan of rain? Uh, not really, but okay. to certain extent, if the, there's certain rain, then good. Got it. Cool. Well, listen, I want to definitely pick your brain about third party messaging platforms. So let's just jump right into the first question I had, which is, why is third party messaging platforms important? Why should companies leverage these solutions? Okay, this is really a good question. First of all, uh, email to certain extent nowadays, uh, we have challenges to reach out to the target audiences, but of course we still need to differentiate the B2B and B2C context. Email is still working well in the B2C, a B2B context, sorry. And B2C, in the B2C context, we have to leverage on those localized marketing uh, uh, third-party messaging systems there because uh, those third-party messaging systems are playing a major role in the communications, marketing communications. Okay, now I'm, I'm, I'm glad you're mentioning the value of third-party messaging platforms. Can you give a specific scenario with this tool? Yeah, so since I'm more focused on China, I would like to pick up WeChat as a specific topic to talk about. So WeChat is a tool actually originally was designed to mimic what's happening from a global perspective. And since WeChat is a local bomb brand, we have culturally, we have more like a connection to the WeChat and more preference to use WeChat. So the local audiences, most of the time, we are adopting into the WeChat communications. We, we, whenever we have day-to-day -day conversations with our uh, peop people and connections, we will leverage on WeChat, voice, video. And when we come into like transactions in shops, we will leverage on WeChat as well for payment, etc. So WeChat from originally um, instant messaging solution growing into an ecosystem or platform nowadays, which dominant in China. And for, for everything we can think of, we can actually find a spot within WeChat. So this is the situation there. That's why we have to work on WeChat as a primary target. I see, okay. Now I've heard from other people in the past that you know, companies will get excited about platforms, new solutions, new technologies. But how can they ensure that, that when they want to make that move and adopt a new solution, how can they make sure that it works both, both locally oh. and globally? Yeah, this is really a good question. So it's true that since the WeChat has already started in China, and of course the local teams, they have already built something surrounding the WeChat. Of course, it could be microsite, it could be certain like promotional activities around the WeChat but uh, there's no conflict for the global team to align with the uh, local team there because those solutions built surrounding the WeChat does not come with an end-to-end -end comprehensive understanding of customer journey life cycle management. While the marketing automation platform we are talking about for the global team is always come, come with these comprehensive end-to-end -end solutions. So with our vertical solution, I have to introduce here and a little bit selling here, so our vertical solution, OC3, is connecting the global matured marketing automation platform to the WeChat so that we enable the global marketing automation platform come with the marketing communication capability through WeChat. This is kind of considered a call, but not really disturbing whatever we have built by the local team around the WeChat, for example, the promotional campaigns or the engagement activities, etc. So this is somehow form up the complete ecosystem and the global solution and local solution that work together. 
That's awesome. And I love how you paint the picture of the whole holistic view, because I think that's important to know as well. Well, well this, this has been great. Thank you for your time with these few questions. If you're watching and you have a question about one of these third party messaging platforms or the vertical connector, please drop us a comment or ask a question and Ming Ming or someone else on our team will get back to you. Otherwise, visit www.vertical.com for more information. And I hope you enjoyed this discussion. Thanks for your time, Ming Ming. Thank you, Payam. Talk soon.